advanced reuse. So in the advanced reuse, uh, unlike before where we just uh, reuse the issue as it is, uh, the user can now reuse an issue and configure the reused issue to their liking, which can help improve workflow and ease of, our, ease of use. To so to show the reuse dialog, uh, let's select select this issue. We right click it and click on copy, and let's paste it in this project as well. So when you click on paste, uh, reuse issue dialog opens and on the not notable parts here are the method which is as of now is blurred since the source and the target project are the same uh here we have a radio button that if uh, should we allow attachments to be copied and a create link our link relation drop down so we can choose if we can add a uh, link relation to both issues. Also, uh, the, the sample tree, which is just a visualization of the reuse. So let's paste this issue. Okay, there it is. So as you can see, uh, the issue is copied with including the screenshot and the link type. Now let's try uh, importing this issue. Let's move to another project here. Uh, this JTP test, to see test project two. And let's paste. So as you can see, uh, the method is now enabled. Now the difference between these two options is that when uh, creating new issues, uh, the selected issue are cloned using the definitions from the content and linking, linking section. And the imported the tree option, uh, which just adds the selected issue to the project without creating new JIRA issues. So let's try importing that issue here. So as you can see, uh, the issue is now imported to this project.